Hello, my name is Simon Chesterman. I'm Dean of the National University of Singapore Faculty of Law and Secretary General of the Asian Society of International Law. It's a great honour to be taking part in this lecture series and podcast. Uh, so what I thought I would do is talk today about what I see as a kind of paradox in international law. Uh, and it's a paradox concerning a region that I've been studying for a decade now, which is Asia. Uh, and in particular, the paradox is that in one sense, Asian states have profited the most from a world that is governed by law, from the order and prosperity that that enables. Asian states have now developed at a rate that is unprecedented in human history. And yet, despite being one of the main beneficiaries of international law institutions, Asian states are, however, the least likely to be members of most international treaty regimes or to be represented in the institutions of global governance in proportion to their number and power. And so what I thought it was interesting to do is to examine why this is the case, to explore why Asian states are, as I say, ambivalent about international law institutions, why they're underrepresented, whether we can explain that, whether it's really a problem, and what might be happening in the near future.